Hey friends, welcome to the channel Mera Shaw. Today we'll be traveling to a state park in Michigan. The park is known as Sterling State Park and it's located in Monroe, Michigan. It's the only state park on Lake Erie with 3,300 acres of land and have a lot of recreational opportunities. So without wasting our time, let's go and get our journey started. The campsite I booked is 184 which was marked on the road and convenient to read. As we explore the campsite, we have a table to eat our stuff and a place to do a wood fire. The site can accommodate two cars or a one RV vehicle. The site also provide you the electric connection which I am walking towards. Here it is. It has an 30 ampere and 20 ampere output supply. So just to figure out where we put our tent. First thing we did after reaching the campsite is setting up our tent. Kids went inside and start enjoying it. I bought this machine to fill up my queen mattresses. It's a battery operated machine with an on off switch. Works on 4D cell batteries with good airflow. It is filling up my queen mattress quite well. It's been a couple of minutes and I can see the inflation in queen mattress. That's good. So my one mattress is done. It's on the second one. Family has been shifted to the one which is done to see the firmness if any more air required. So this is how we set up our tent. On the left we have an queen mattress on the right we have a full mattress and in between we have some space to walk so we have our bed sheet on looks quite neat and sleep ready though we are not sleeping now we does have an electricity connection over here so I put this LED lights need to be done correctly got pen from home and has been using this extension cord which I bought from Amazon I'll put the link in the description if you are interested it has a surge protection so the important thing why I chose this site to put a tent is it's near to this electricity connection provided so I just took my socket and inserted and switched on the 20 ampere plug so I have a current in my tent after setting up a tent we were really hungry and started eating our food which we got from home. We got Rajma Chawal and nobody can say no to Rajma Chawal. It's an amazing dish. After having our lunch, first thing we did is exploring the bathrooms and toilet. And the thing that amazed me that the toilets in there is very neat and clean and they do have a permanent toilet, not the temporary one. They also have the vending machines uh, which have some food, drinks and all. The best thing about this vending machines are they do support a credit card, contactless one and you can also pay via Apple Pay. So if you are hungry, in the middle of the night, they get you covered. It's the best thing I like about the park. So that's it. And as we explore around, I saw a map of Michigan state parks it cover all the state parks from North Michigan to Central Michigan and to Southern Michigan I was trying to locate our state park which is on Lake Orin and I was able to find one so we are at the Southern Michigan here we are As we walk around to explore more about the state park, on the left you can see coming up as the shelter which can be booked with the state park with some minimum fees and you can host a party over here. So in the shelter 
around 50 people can accommodate easily and can party state also give you a big barbecue so you, to, you just need to carry your food and your party ready in front of beach quite good so we circled back where we started in the front is my site so we took a complete round circle around the campsite now we'll be moving to some other direction to explore the park more as we move in another direction I see the state park also have this wood houses but their number is limited so if you wanna stay in one just look for it and if you find it book it because this goes very soon the patio of these wood house open in front of beach so it's quite amazing view I really wanted to stay in one of those but I didn't get the availability so as we moved around more in the state park we found that the track itself is very amazing it's along the water side so we are really enjoying walking over there it's quite clean and cool despite of getting yourself bored let's complete our walk faster As we move forward, we also find that State Park also have a kids playing area with a lot of, lot of things to do. Small swing for a kid. I'm just walking around and showing you all the different things that they have. the play area itself is very big and if you see the ground of this area it's some rubbery stuff so even if the kid falls it doesn't get high a lot of activities to do for the kids and kids really gonna enjoy this different knees and swings and slides after playing for a while we say goodbye to the play area and move forward we saw a food truck here which is selling some basic stuff to fill your stomach and it was also selling ice in case you become short so you cannot go hungry if you have money from here so we move forward in our journey a little faster the walk here itself is quite amazing water banging the rocks the noise it creates is very good it's so calm you feel like walking here whole day and it relaxes your mind. It's so good, so amazing. Yes. The 
this route took us to a deck where people come for fishing but even you can come for a walk the walk itself is quite amazing you will fall in love with this place as you walk the more you walk the more you find let's have a 270 degree view of this place see the sky so blue water so dark amazing scenic beauty after spending our evening in walking we came to beach just to relax and have our lazy lamhe along the shore of the beach i found beach it's a very clean and few families enjoying the beaches are just in to the campsites and the wood villa so the walk to the tents is no more than couple of minutes the water is clean and very enjoyable have some dips in the water play at beach made us really hungry so we started for our food in the meantime we want thought of enjoying a little so i have on my time already and in the meantime i just connected all the barbecue stuff so that timer is for getting my grill ready so the waiting is about to end food is getting ready and i'm happy the hard work paid off food is approved by the great chef of the house good morning this is how we slept last night in our sleeping bags i did a little modification i placed all these led lights in a bag and hung it on the top so it was quite efficient got up and captured sunrise i want you to hear this so our breakfast is getting ready we did an experiment to prepare maggi in aluminum foil now it's time to pack our stuff the same pump is deflating the air mattress it is taking all the air out so i have already deflated my other mattress now it's going on to the bigger one and we said goodbye to the campsite 